What's happening guys? Welcome to a brand new episode of Badge 3D. I'm just here in the workshop today and I've been getting a lot of questions on my Instagram and also my YouTube um, as to where you can get free or even paid files and how to tell the difference between what's a good file that will actually print and one that won't. What do you mean, sassy? So there's a number of different places that you can get them from online. Uh, a lot of the places are free, and then we'll also look at some places where you can pay to get files done for you, or files that they might even have in their library. Okay, AFK. So the first website I'm gonna start with today is My Mini Factory. Now the reason why this is my favorite is because all the files are free, and secondly, they're guaranteed 3D printable files. Okay, so next up is the very well-known Thingiverse. This is probably the actual number one place that people go to get files. The only problem is anyone can upload a file, so not everything is guaranteed that it can be 3D printable. So you'll just have to do your own research to verify that. And the way you can do that is by looking at some of the thumbnails. If the thumbnail is a final 3D printed part, then it's obviously being printed. But if it's still just a file on the software itself, um, you might want to just double check that before you download it and print it. Another place I use is CG Trader. Uh, this place you do actually have to pay. Oh, what's this? Um, what's this at the top? 120 bucks. Oh. I'm sure there's terms and conditions, but sometimes I use this place because you can get some fairly decent 3D models from here uh, from independent designers who upload them uh, for the sole purpose of obviously making money. A lot of the 3D models that I've got here are very, very good. A lot of designers are also going to chuck up their designs and work on Etsy. Um, I wanted to check out this one, it was Yondu's Finn from Guardians of the Galaxy 2 and um, Uncle Jesse printed this and I just thought it was such a cool file. I can see that this one's been done up in Fusion 360 but yeah definitely don't overlook Etsy for 3D files. Now the last place I'm going to tell you about is Do3D. Now I personally love these guys. I got my Deathstroke uh, Arkham Knight 3D files off, off these guys. Um, I was able to scale that to my 3D scan of my body. Um, they're also working on my uh, Superman armor from Injustice 2. Uh, as you've probably seen in my previous video, I've already got the headpiece. Um, I've printed that mask that you can see there in the picture as well. I just did it way too big when I had absolutely no idea what I was doing. I still kind of don't, but hey, you guys are listening to me, so I must. But um, yeah, no, really happy with Do3D. They've done me some um, great stuff in the past, and I'll probably continue to use them. So that's basically it for today guys, I'm going to wrap it up there, I'm getting really hungry and I want to make myself um, something to eat, but as per usual, leave me some feedback below in the comments as to you know where else you might be able to find some 3D files or where other sites that you guys have tried that you really like. Also don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button, it really helps me out. Um, please share my video if you can, I'm really trying to hit 10,000 views at the moment so that YouTube can... Uh, review my channel and uh yeah if you got any feedback in general you know what to do Very good. Very good. Oh. <laughs> love you badge